far as Tony Rumble goes, I never worked for him. Um, I didn't really know him at all. He uh, booked me once and I showed up and found out that I was booked against a ring rat. So I left. Right. Um, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so that, that didn't work out. <laughs> that, that's, so, that's, uh, um, that's back to the point about being green again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So this was a completely untrained girl, and and um, I just wasn't going to get in the ring at all. And, you know, what's really sad is that I could have been wrestling in, in Pennsylvania that night, and I took the local booking because he came to me first, but... I was pretty disappointed when I got there. And of course he, he didn't pay me obviously cause I didn't work. Um, and then, you know, he tried to book me again and he didn't want to pay what I was getting, which was very reasonable. Um, he told me that he will just get a few strippers for $20 each. So, um, oh. yeah. Yep. So what that's was, what he what thought was, about women wrestling. Yeah. What was that conversation like then when you got there and you, they were saying you were going to fight this rat or what was the kind of conversation behind it? Did you, you asked obviously who you're going to be working with and what, what kind of way did the conversation go? Yeah, I just went up to him and I said, who's my opponent? Because I saw the girl there, never dreamed it was going to be her. And he told me who it was. And I said, absolutely not. You don't have a trained wrestler for me to work with. And, you know, like I said, he had absolutely no respect for women's wrestling whatsoever. So um, I just said, well, you don't have an opponent for me. See ya. And I walked out. <laughs>